What's good, YouTube Eagle fan? One five nine. You're coming at you with two of these uh, Mega Draco Sack value boxes. I found these at my local Target. They're actually on sale for twelve ninety nine each. So I figured, get the Mega Draco Sack, the sleeves, and six booster packs for twelve ninety nine. You really can't beat that. So I had to uh, pick up two of them for you guys, and uh, let's get right into it. I'm gonna cut the video and uh, take up all the stuff from the boxes. All right. So uh, warning before you guys buy any of these, just remember that. With the uh, <laughs> belly boxes, they have uh, glue on the packs, so uh, just keep that in mind. Uh, we got the two Draco sacks here. One unfortunately has some edge wear, but that's okay. They're super cool. You get the two packs of official Konami sleeves. Now, uh, of course, the Draco sacks can't be used in an official tournament duel anyway, so edge wear, of course, does not matter. Uh, on these back of the belly boxes, it shows um, the six packs that you should get, but both of the value boxes here have different packs. So this is the on the right, Primal Origins, Judgment of Light, Fist Rising, Lord of Texan Galaxy, Cosmo Glitz, and a second Primal Origin. So got that for that. On the right side we have first edition Primal Origin. These ones are unlimited. Uh, two first edition Primal Origin, two number hunters, Lord of Texan Galaxy, and Cosmo Glazer. So I guess we'll throw them all in one big stack and then we can just go from there so set the sleeves and the draco sacks aside this should be a super cool opening bunch of random packs so all right i guess the, the clue is uh, absolutely crazy all right first pack primal origin dawn knights Origin number two, Pixies Universe. That's a pretty good rare. All right, Judgment of the Light, first edition. Archfiend Emperor, the first Lord of Horror. All right, so we're three for three so far. That's okay. Oh, Magic Deflector, that's actually a pretty good common to get out of this set. Mermail Abyss Pike. Okay, well hopefully our only foils aren't out of just the Number Hunters pack, so... Uh, Lord of Techie on Galaxy here. CXC's Dark Fairy Cheerio, and a Sacred Sword of Seven Stars, that's a pretty good super rare to get. All right, Cosmo Blazer. Herald Beast of Leo, an Orbital 7, super rare. Okay, getting some foils now. Can't uh, be Cosmo Blazer without Chris, Crimson Sunbird, of course. All right, back to Primal Origin. Bolt Penguin, uh, number C80, Requiem and Berserk, and Avalon, okay, super rare. I believe that's three in a row for super rares. All right, next pack of Prime Origins. What is this, 100 footed horror? <laughs> that's awesome. Ghost Trick, so cute box, and uh, so cute bo boss. Not box, my bad. And Seven Sage, Sage Koya. That's an awesome ultra rare. I've played, played in the Sylvan deck. Alright, we got two number hunters. I don't really know what's really good in this set, but I guess we're about to see. CXC's Simon the Great Moral Leader. Okay. Let's put that in our foils. Of course they're all foils, but technically super rares count as common since there's no commons in the set, so. Oh, that's a pretty good one. Mech equipped Anganeer and Photon Alexandra Queen. Okay, you can put the Mech equipped Anganeer in there too. Uh, Lord of on Galaxy. Uh, 
very cheer girl. Oh, and a totem bird seeker rare. That's awesome. It's a super cool to get a seeker rare of these value boxes. So of course, all the packs are kind of random. Now, last pack, Cosmo Blazer. Let's see what we can get. Infernity Archer, and that's it. Alright, that's it for this video. Be sure to give this video a like and subscribe to my channel for new videos every Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and Saturday. And uh, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Peace.